so the first member of the art squad I'm going to be talking about is Vanna. She was my favorite member when I saw all the dolls for the first time. Now the side of the box says where art meets a fashion and we have a picture of Vanna. And now with the doll, it looks like we are getting DIY crafts for me and Vanna to do together. We can paint her jacket and we can paint the flower clip that she comes with. We can also color her accessories. And there's a QR code down here that you can scan to join the art squad. And here's all of the other members. Now right here it says, Ivana is classic and cute. Her birthday is April 11th. Her favorite color is coral pink. Her personality is friendly and outgoing. Her favorite thing to do is go stargazing. Her favorite art style is a painting. Her favorite style is a colorful mix of pieces. And her favorite art tool is a paintbrush. And here is a close-up of Vanna. Now, let's get her open. So here is Vanna all out of her box. It was quite an easy box to open, and she comes with a lot more than I thought she did. The first thing I opened up was this little flower keychain that you can color and paint yourself. This really awesome paint brush and palette and flower hairbrush. She also comes with three markers so that you can color her picture, her clothes, her accessories, I mean really anything you want. Because she is a painting girl, she comes with these paints that are real paint. And she comes with a real paintbrush, which I definitely will be using myself. Here is her photo frame, and there she is inside of it, and you can color it with either the paint or the markers all yourself. And the frame does have a little back part of it so that it does lay flat. These are also really cool. They go on her eyes as if they were fake little eyeshadow and eyelashes. So now for the best part, the doll. This is Vanna. She comes with a gold and flower headband, but now you can either paint or color her headband for her. Now these dolls have larger heads compared to their body, but she has got some brown eyebrows and gold eyeshadow. Her eyes are a yellowy orangey brown and she's got blush all over. That's the cutest, that's my favorite. And she has on some pink lipstick. Now her earrings are huge. They are giant gold and little white paint brushes that you can paint yourself. It comes with this blue little bracelet. Something I really like is that the dolls come with elastics so they can stay in their pose like they were in the box. I love her little blue jean jacket. It has golden buttons and golden stitching in it. But the best part about the jacket is that it has this little clear thing in it on the back and you can pull out this paper and draw whatever you want on her jean jacket. Her hair comes in a ponytail, but it is supposed to be taken out. So now she has a brown and yellow hair and it's pulled up into two little pigtails on the top of her head. Hair, of course, has these gorgeous big curls. I actually like it a lot. There is no gel in it, and the rooting is pretty good. Now, I accidentally took off the elastic on the earrings. Now they keep falling off. I'm sorry, I'm gonna take them out for now. He has on a short sleeve white and gold shirt with little flowers on it. She has these corally silky shorts on over some white and gold matching leggings. Now I am actually loving her shoes so much. We've got these sandals on that are like light blue, coral, and then they have like this big giant yellow flower right in front. Now this doll is actually super articulated. Her head goes left and right. She has articulation at the upper arm, the elbow, the hand, and it goes every which way. We have articulation at the hips, the knees, and the legs can rotate. So you could have it to the side, or forward, or even the other side. These dolls also come with an awesome doll stand that the bottom is a paint palette. The doll also comes with this cool backdrop so that you can take pictures of her in front of it. Now, of course, you can start painting in her outfit, her accessories, 
her picture, but I am not going to do that because I am a collector and that goes against my heart. But of course you do whatever you want with your own dolls. I'm just not gonna personally. So there you guys go, that is Vanna. Um, she was my favorite when I first saw the dolls, but we will have to open the rest and see who the favorite ends up being. So that is all for now, until next time when I unbox the rest of the art squad. Thank you.